I want to make a quick video about how to temporarily resolve the issue where Tesla, the autopilot, will be phantom braking during the highways. So I'm driving from Albuquerque, New Mexico to Denver, Colorado. And during a section between the two borders, uh, you can see that's a lot of uh, grasses and wide open land, there's no traffic. But for some reason, these road conditions, Tesla is uh, really bad with uh, phantom braking on its autopilot. The phantom braking almost shows up like every few seconds and the cars will be constantly stopping, sometimes small, sometimes really big, really hard brake. And it makes uh, self-driving um, on the autopilot completely unusable. So one way I find that for a temporary fix was that I step on my gas pedals uh, with my feet constantly. But with that, the pedal is going down a little bit constantly. So I keep my feet on my pedals uh, constantly and press down a little bit, quite a bit, quite a bit hard. I find that I can press my pedal quite a bit, quite a bit down there constantly. Yeah, the velocity on the screen with a whatever cruise control speed I set it wouldn't be increasing. <laughs> but the phantom brake issues will be uh, quite a bit less where the car think I'm over uh, driving it, overriding it uh, constantly. Uh, of course, only do that when the traffic in front of you is uh, actually clear and you know you're safe doing this way. A lot of phantom braking where I can see on my screens that uh, Tesla is making decisions about either need to change lane immediately or braking, but I don't feel like that during the uh, when I'm driving. So that's kind of like my temporary fixes for the phantom braking issue on the highway when I'm driving fast. And I do hope Tesla uh, eventually upgrade their software so that this uh, phantom braking issue is uh, resolved on the highway. Um, so, like, so the car is actually able to drive itself instead of uh, right now if I leave it alone, the phantom braking is so bad that the car is really not self-driving, it's not really usable. So it's really frustrating when you uh, have a, such a nice car but you can't do the basic stuff.